Is it okay if I film what you guys eat today? People want to know what kinds of food you eat. Well, okay. Okay, what do we got here? Can you mix it around, show everybody? You're not happy about this choice. Is it good? Yeah. Good. If you're new here, we are a vegan family. My kids eat a vegan diet and I try to keep it very healthy. They eat primarily whole food plant-based, but there are a couple elements in there that are not considered whole food plant-based, like a flour tortilla. For context, Naya is three years old and Eli is six years old. I try and keep things very simple for them and that's what they like and it actually makes it easier on me. And if I'm making a more elaborate meal for myself and my husband, I always look at the components of that meal and see how I can feed my kids. So I'm not making 10 different meals at once because I've been there and it makes me feel crazy, but I'm using the same ingredients and maybe just repurposing them to my kids' liking. If you like this video and you wanna see more what I eat in the days, let me know down in the comments below. And if you're new here, please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. This is Naya's little snack lunch that she's taking to her half day preschool. I've got homemade bread with vegan cream cheese and chives on there. She likes carrots and cucumber because she is a bunny and a little cutie, and that's normally enough to sustain her, and then she has lunch when she comes home. And that's her little lunchbox. Oh, Naya, Jack. Love you, girl. I love you. I'm gonna pull up your So I just picked up Naya from school. I'm gonna give her her smoothie. Um, this is always really great for Naya. Eli won't have smoothies anymore, but I love that I can get extra greens in for her. There you go, my love. I don't know about you, but as soon as we get in the car, my kids always want something to eat. So for packaged snacks, I try to really, really be cautious of the ingredients. Um, so I have these, which are these fruit rolls. I just get these at Costco. The ingredients are really, really simple and it's essentially just dehydrated fruit. I also do these, which I get from Costco. The ingredient list for these ones are a little bit longer, um, but they're not too bad. And then I'll just do like raw nuts. And sometimes I have like little snack packs of raw nuts from Costco or I'll just bring some. Other snacks that I use are just fresh fruit. Cuties are great because they're those little tiny um, like tangelos or, or mandarins. I'm not sure what they are exactly. Apples, bananas. I always just bring water for them and then some fruit that we can just peel. Fruit is a great snack for children. It's the complete package of water and fiber and sugar to keep you going and it's low in calories density and so it's great for a snack for me or my kids oh my girl she couldn't make it i want to be here what are we gonna make a burrito jesus <laughs> So typically I will make these things ahead of time. I always make a batch of beans because he likes burritos. I'll make some rice at the top of the week and I always make um, some kind of cheese sauce. So this makes making lunch really easy. And make sure you get it all over the place. I always chop the lettuce really finely and then that way it's not such, so much of a shock when he's eating the burrito. And now I'm just warming up the beans and rice for the inside of the burrito. Avocado! Yes, avocado! So Naya doesn't like burritos, but I'm going to be using the same elements to create a different meal for her so it's less work for me. But she's gonna have rice, avocado, and some edamame, which she really enjoys. Beans and jump on rice. That's what I just love about burritos. And then I mix it all so together. Mushy. There, you like the mushiness. Hot. Then I just warm it up over the stove so that it's extra toasty and good. Wee. Do like this, like I could pretend to eat it. Uh huh. It's just go like, but then I don't know who would like that. Oh, I'm curious. Who might like to eat that burrito? Ready? <laughs> With spicy, fast, and stiff slow. So I used to get really frustrated with my kids not eating what I wanted them to eat. And I just kind of came up with this concept of a whole plate where I just have some whole fruits, vegetables, and different things that they can kind of buffet on their plate. And then whatever they eat, they eat. And I try to keep the drama out of it. I'm not always very good at it. So the whole plate or the buffet plate, whatever you want to call it, is an easy way if you've got picky eaters to just offer them good food. And a mama. Big at a mama. Yeah, big at a mama makes you stronger like a mama. <laughs> oh. Oh. 
How's your peach? <laughs> we're gonna go for a little hike. The sun is already behind the mountain, so we're gonna go quick. I hear a waterfall. Yes. It's a perfect little hike for the kids. It's like just short enough, and there's water at the end, which always makes us always so very happy. And the leaves are turning colors and it's so beautiful. What were you touching, my love? <laughs> oh, all right. So I can't express how much meal prepping saves me. I made this easy vegetable soup um, at the top of the week and this is what we're gonna have for dinner. It works for my kids, for me, and for my husband. So the good thing about this is that it makes eight servings. So what I typically do is make a big batch and then I freeze half of it. So add maybe a good handful of this pasta in there. This is fantastic when we have like activities in the afternoon. I don't really have to think or spend a lot of time on dinner. Ew, I cracked my bone. Mommy, this finger is... Thank you God for the whole road. We just hope that everybody will have a good night's sleep. And we hope that Every one of the people in Israel too will be okay. Yeah, I love you guys. Amen. Amen. Oh. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> Remember that London, London bridge is falling down? London bridge is falling down. Yeah, I totally huh? remember that. If you want the queso dip that Eli had in his burrito, it's in Eating Whole, and I will leave this soup recipe down below. It's on my website. Bye bye. <laughs> Mommy. Thank you guys for showing everybody what you ate today. I appreciate it. Bye!